He washed over me, he gave me the ability to accomplish my mission. And on the other side, back home, I have no bad news. I give thanks to God for that. Amen. Amen. I am very happy. And I am always happy to come and serve you. Amen. Amen. This morning is a special morning. I am not going to preach. But I will teach. Je m'a fait grâce avec la capacité d'enseigner. God gave me the grace to teach. Et lorsqu'on enseigne, on est en train de poser les papins les uns sur les autres. And uh, when uh, we are teaching, we are laying blocks on top of one another. Plusieurs d'entre vous, si vous avez été à l'école, ou vous êtes encore en train d'aller à l'école, Many among you here have been have gone to school or maybe are still in school. Uh, pour acquérir de la connaissance. It's to acquire some knowledge. Et je vais vous dire la vérité. And I'll tell you the truth. L'ignorance est une arme de destruction massive utilisée par les ennemis pour détruire les gens. Uh, ignorance is a weapon of mass destruction used by the enemy to destroy people. L'ignorance n'est pas une bonne chose. Ignorance is not a good thing. L'apôtre Paul a dit, the apostle Paul said, aussi longtemps qu'un héritier demeure enfant, as long as the heir remains a child, il ne diffère pas d'un esclave. He is no different from a slave. Je vous en prie, soyez attentifs parce que vous êtes posé dans des choses qui peuvent changer votre vie. I beg you be focused because I will deposit in your lives things that can change your life. You go to school to acquire the world's knowledge. But God gave us the knowledge to dominate, to lead, and to direct in this world. Et vous avez besoin de cette connaissance. And you need that knowledge. Si vous êtes ignorant de ce que Dieu vous a donné, quelqu'un d'autre viendra régner à votre place. If you know ignorant of what God gave you, somebody else will come and reign to you. Est-ce qu'on peut dire Amen? Amen. amen. J'étais à Atlanta la semaine passée. I was in Atlanta last week. J'étais rencontré celui qu'on appelle souvent un mentor, un père spirituel. I was uh, down there to meet somebody that we usually call a mentor or a spiritual father. C'est un Américain très riche. That man is a very rich American. 
Quelqu'un d'autre dirait, je m'en vais chez l'Américain pour qu'il me donne de l'argent. Somebody could say I'm going to see the American so he give me some money. Je vous dis, c'est un homme très riche. I'm telling you, he's a very rich man. Et quand je suis arrivé chez lui, when I got to his home, il a dit, je ne vais pas te, je ne vais pas te loger dans les appartements qui sont dans ma propriété. He said, I'm not going to lodge in the apartments that are in my property. Je vais te faire dormir dans la chambre de mon fils. I'm going to make you sleep in my son's bedroom. Parce que je te considère comme mon fils. Because I consider you like my son. Amen. Et tous les matins, and every morning, je vais avoir un moment de l'étude biblique avec toi. I'm going to have a time of Bible study with you. Et à midi, and at midday, on va manger. We will eat. Après le, après le repas, and after the meal, je vais te faire connaître la ville. I will make you know the city around. C'est comme ça que ça doit fonctionner pendant quatre jours. So that's how it worked for four days. C'était merveilleux. And it was wonderful. Il m'a enseigné des choses très importantes. He taught me some very important things. Il m'a dit ceci. He told me this. Je ne te donnerai pas de l'argent. I'm not going to give you any money. Je ne t'ai pas connecté à moi pour que je te donne de l'argent. God did not connect you to me for me to give you Mais money. Mais comme je suis comme Dieu m'a béni, But since God has blessed me, moi aussi je vais te bénir. Me too, I'm going to bless you. Et il m'a fait comprendre ce que c'est que le principe de la bénédiction. And he made me understand the principle of blessing. Ce pas des choses que j'ignorais. Those are not things that I was ignoring. Je les connaissais déjà. I know them already. Mais il, Dieu a permis que cela soit d'actualité dans ma vie. But God allowed those things to become actual. Il y a souvent une confusion entre la bénédiction et la richesse. I tell you the confusion between blessing and richness. Plusieurs confondent la bénédiction à la richesse. Many confound, confuse blessings and richness. Yes. La bénédiction n'est pas la richesse. But blessing is not richness. Amen. Mais la bénédiction produit la richesse. But blessing Amen. produces richness. C'est Dieu qui bénit. It is God who blesses. Et ce qu'il nous a donné and what he gave us attire les richesses. Attracts riches. La bénédiction The blessing is spiritual. Parce que Dieu est bénédiction. Because God is blessing. Maintenant, now, c'est à notre responsabilité de transporter cette bénédiction en richesse. It's up to us to transport that blessing into riches. Si vous voulez de convertir cette bénédiction en richesse. Or if you want to convert that blessing into riches. C'est le privilège de vous dire que nous tous qui sommes ici, nous sommes bénis. And the privilege to tell us that all of us here, we are blessed. Mais la différence est, ce, ce, la différence se pose au niveau de la conversion de cette bénédiction. But the difference is found at the conversion of that blessing. Comment faire pour que cette bénédiction soit matérialisée? How to get that blessing to be materialized? C'est comme quelqu'un est allé à l'école. It's like somebody who went to school. Il a appris beaucoup de choses à l'école. He's learned many things at school. Mais ce qu'il a appris, il ne peut pas l'aider à, à, à être ce qu'il est appelé à être. But what he learned cannot help him to become what he was called to be. Car ce qu'il soit opérationnel dans le monde. Until it becomes operational in the world. Tu vas tu as appris. You've learned. Mais si tu ne valorises pas ce que tu as appris. But if you do not value what you've learned. Par la mise en pratique de ce que tu as appris. By putting it into practice. Tu mourras pauvre. You will die poor. Alléluia. Alléluia. Et depuis trois jours, j'ai dit à votre pasteur. It was uh, three days now I've been telling your pastor. J'ai dit à votre pasteur ce que Dieu a mis dans mon cœur pour vous. I told him what God has put in my heart for you guys. Est-ce que quelqu'un dans cette salle sait que c'est Dieu qui pourvoit à tous ses besoins? Does somebody in this hall knows that it is God who provides for all the needs? Alléluia. Alléluia. 
C'est très difficile de le comprendre. It's very difficult to understand it. Mais c'est la vérité. But that is the truth. Il y a plusieurs qui pensent que many think that c'est parce qu'il travaille qu'il mange. It's because the work that they eat. Je connais les gens qui travaillent. I know people who work et qui ne parviennent pas à manger ce qu'ils gardent. But who cannot eat the income they make. Il y a des gens qui pensent que there are some people who think that c'est parce qu'ils font beaucoup de fois qu'ils réussissent. It's because they make so many efforts that they succeed. C'est le mensonge. That's the lie. La Bible me dit. Bible tells me. Le Dieu de l'Alliance, the God of Covenant, te donnera la force, will give you the strength, la guérir tous ces richesses, to acquire all those riches. Amen. 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 To acquire all those riches. And that's what he tells you. Souviens-toi. Remember that it is I who gives you the strength to acquire all those riches. Lorsque tu seras riche, when you be rich, souviens-toi. Remember that it is I who gives you the strength to acquire all those riches. C'est ça le problème aux États-Unis. That is a problem in the US. Et même dans le monde. Et même dans le monde. Les gens courent après de l'argent. People run after money. Parce qu'ils croient que. Because they think that. C'est en ayant de l'argent. It's by having money. Qu'on pourra résoudre les problèmes. That we can solve all problems. La Bible me dit. The Bible tells me. Que c'est Dieu. That it is God. Qui donne à manger à toute chair. Who gives a food to all flesh. You say what to be. Read your Bible. We don't have much more time. Mais un jour, but one day, l'apôtre Paul, l'apôtre Paul, fut reçu dans une église. Was received in the church. Et l'église qu'il avait abondamment béni. A church that abundantly blessed him. Dès qu'il a reçu toutes ces bénédictions, et la soeur a reçu tous ces blessings, il s'est assis. He sat. Il a dit. He said, tout ce que vous avez fait. All that you did was not for me. But you did it to fill your own account. Amen. 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 Each one of you here has an account in heaven. Et tu dois savoir la provisionner. Et tu dois savoir comment le faire. Tout comme tu as provisionné. Just as you provide ton compte. Ton compte en guerre. Pour ton compte de l'account. Capital One. In a Capital One. Au Bank America. Au Bank America. Au Bank America. Alléluia. Alléluia. C'est la même chose. It's the same thing. Que tu dois faire. That you must do. Approvisionner ton corps. To fill your account. J'ai l'impression que je dis les choses à l'air. I feel I'm just speaking in a vacuum. Si vous voulez, je vous montre ces écritures. C'est écrit. If you know, if you want, I can show you those scriptures. It's written in the Bible. Yes, hallelujah. Vous laissez ma Bible. I left my Bible back home. Mais ouvre ta Bible en Philippiens chapitre 4. Open your Bible in Philippians chapter 4. Philippians chapter 4. Philippians chapter 4. Story of La version semeur dit ceci. Et il va prendre après, il va prendre après que j'ai fini de lire. Mais je vais traduire la lecture. Il dit Pendant mon séjour à Thessalonique, vous m'avez envoyé par deux fois 
des dons pour subvenir à mes besoins. Ce n'est pas que je tienne à recevoir ce don. Ce qui m'intéresse, c'est qu'un plus nombre de fruits soient portés à votre actif. Voilà, c'est l'économie et pas l'économie. Actif, passif. For even when I was in the Thessalonica, you sent me help for my needs more than once. Not that I seek the gift, but I seek the profit that accumulates to your account. To your account. À votre compte. Je voulais que quelqu'un me pêche un compte. I would like someone to be paid. Quelqu'un me pêche un compte. Quelqu'un me pêche un compte. L'ignorance tue. Ignorance kills. Qu'est-ce que Paul dit? What does Paul say? Il dit, vous avez fait ça parce que je suis intéressé. Il dit, vous avez fait ça parce que je suis intéressé. Mais si il y a un intérêt pour moi, c'est que chacun de vous a approuvé son compte. Il dit, chacun de vous a fait son compte. Il dit, chacun de vous a fait son compte. Il dit, chacun de vous a fait son compte. Il dit, chacun de vous a fait son compte. Il dit, chacun de vous a fait son compte. Il dit, chacun de vous a fait son compte. Il dit, chacun de vous a fait son compte. Il dit, chacun de vous a fait son compte. Tu as un compte au ciel. I'm an account in heaven. Et si j'ai un conseil à vous donner, et il va y avoir un advice pour vous. Et chercher à approvisionner ce compte. It's to try and fill that account. Oui. Yes. Pourquoi? Why? J'ai souvent entendu. I've sometimes heard que les banques aux États-Unis, that the banks in the U.S. sont en faillite. Fail. Vous vous êtes vous n'êtes pas parfait le monde. Vous êtes ici. Non, 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 et quand la banque va faillite, when the bank goes bankrupt, je ne souhaiterais pas. I will not wish. Je dis, God says, vaut mieux chercher à garder votre trésor là où la rouille et la terre n'arrivent pas. It's better for you guys to keep your treasuries in a place where a rust does not get there. Où aucun voleur ne pas arriver. Oh, where no thief can get there. S'il vous plaît, que Dieu vous aide à changer votre mental. Please, may God help us to change your mind. Dis encore de voir j'ai un compte au ciel. C'est là où il y a un compte au ciel. C'est un compte au ciel. C'est un compte au ciel. La vérité. Le truc. Vous êtes que je vous ai dit, vous enseignez. I told you that today I'm going to teach you. Le secret de la bénédiction. Le secret of blessing. Alors, now. Si tu as un compte au ciel, if you have an account in heaven, comment est-ce que tu peux l'approvisionner? How can you accumulate it? C'est ce que tu dois savoir. That's what you need to know. S'il n'est pas approvisionné, x. S'il n'est pas approvisionné, if it's not filled, if that if that account is not filled, tu ne peux rien prendre. You cannot take anything from it. S'il n'y a rien dans ton compte, there is nothing in your account. N'espère rien. Do not expect anything. Tel que les États-Unis sont bâtis sur la loi, the way the U.S. are built on law. Je sais pas si quelqu'un, quelqu'un comme bon, quelqu'un va se lever et dire, je m'en vais. On donne l'argent dans cette banque-là. Je m'en vais prendre l'argent. I don't know if somebody can say, okay, since people go and put the money in that bank, I'm just going to go there and then get some money from it. Je te supplie de ne pas le faire. I beg you to not do it. Parce que la police viendra te ramasser par le bain. Because police will come catch you and you will regret the day you were born. Alléluia. Alléluia. Est-ce que tu veux savoir comment tu peux approcher ton corps? Do you know what to do or how you can accumulate your account? If you want to know, lift up your hand. Lift up your hand. Say, Lord, je veux savoir. I want to know. Ce matin, this morning, comment approvisionner mon corps? Fill my account. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. On a des gens qui sont éduqués. Et permettez-moi d'utiliser ce mot-là. We have people that are, allow me to use this word. 
There are some people who are broke. Qui ont des problèmes financiers de du premier jour de l'année jusqu'au dernier jour. Who have financial problems from the first day of the year till the last day of the year. Mais ils prient Dieu. But they pray God. Ils vont à l'église. They go to church. Ils jeûnent. They even fast. But nothing changes. I will tell you the truth. Fast and pray will never cast away poverty. Do you want to keep going? Praying and fasting will procure, bring healing, but not money. So go on, pray and fast in the morning. Don't go just pray and fast in the morning. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, good day. Hey, good day. Hey, good day. Hey, good day. Listen to me carefully. I like it when you guys are happy. Don't forget the truth. Amen. 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 Avec sagesse. God made things with wisdom. Il y a rien qui soit au hasard. There was nothing made by accident. Je vais donner un exemple. I'm giving an example. Il y a la guérison. There is healing. Il y a la prospérité financière. There is financial prosperity. Les deux choses se trouvent dans la Bible. Both things are found in the Bible. Mais tu ne vas pas utiliser les mêmes moyens pour les deux choses. But you will not use the same means for both. Alléluia. Alléluia. Quand ta voiture est malade, when your car is sick, tu appelles le mécanicien. You call the mechanics. Tu ne vas pas appeler le docteur. You don't go and call the physician. Quand tu es malade, when you are sick, tu ne vas pas chez le mécanicien. You don't go to the mechanic. Tu vas chez le docteur. You go to the doctor. Mais le véhicule, but your vehicle, qui te l'a allé quelque part, te déplacer, that helps you to ground, can fall sick. Ton corps, your body, peut tomber en bas, can have a problem. Dieu a donné les moyens, les secrets, les les principes pour que tu puisses approcher de ton corps. So God gave some means, some principle for you to take care of your body. Tout ce que tu as besoin dans la Bible. All that you need in the Bible. Et tu peux mourir pauvre tout en restant enfant de Dieu. But you can die poor while being a child of God. Et c'est un choix. And that's a choice. Tu veux prospérer? You want to prosper? Tu vas prospérer. You will prosper. Amen. Tu veux rester pauvre? You want to remain poor? Comme le vieux Lazare. Like the old Lazarus. Qui est mort avec les plaies partout. Who died with wounds all over his body. Tu vas mourir pauvre. You will die poor. Mais tu vas au ciel. But you have heaven. Tu vas au ciel. You will go to heaven. Mais tu vas mourir pauvre. But you will die poor. Pourquoi Dieu veut que tu prospères? Pourquoi Dieu veut que tu aies de l'argent? Why does God want you to have money? C'est pas pour que tu tu t'en ouvres. It's not for you to become too proud about it. No, no. It's for lui d'abord. It's first of all for himself. He says it's a sign. He says it's a sign. For his covenant with you. It's a sign. It's a sign. It's a demarcation. It's a standing apart. It's a proof. He is the God who commands gold and silver. But we have on the natural plane, rich parents, and his family is there. But miserable children. What's your question? 
one day got this. Qu'est-ce qui est arrivé pour que cet enfant ne bénéficie pas de la richesse de son père? What has happened for this child not to benefit from his parents' riches? Certainement, il n'a pas fait ce que le père attendait qu'il fasse. Certainly, he didn't do what the father was expecting from him. C'est la même chose. It's the same thing. Job said, "Job said, 'I've blessed the poor. I have blessed the poor. And the benediction that came down the poor has been shown. And the blessing that was in the poor came to me. Because the poor ignored that he was blessed. Because the poor was ignored of the fact that he was blessed. There are people who ignore that they are blessed. There are some people who ignore that they are blessed. There are some people who ignore that they are blessed. There are some pour que cette bénédiction soit And you don't do what you're supposed to do for that blessing to be realized. So Job, if you bring the man to God, come and take himself what you have. Come on, how? He says that you have. He knows that you have. He can take away. He comes and gives you. I don't know. In giving you, he will take away what you have. He will take away what you have. There are some people who only expect people to give them. Because they have the mentality that they are poor. They don't know that the little that they have can twinkle in your own. I do not have. I do not have. I don't have. I don't have. I cannot. You lie. You do not change the situation if you do not decide to do something that is difficult. You cannot change your situation if you don't decide to do something that will challenge you. I love this illustration. The sportive athletes. They have a movement that they call the split. The split is to go like this. But it's not everybody that can do it. Pour y arriver, to do it, à mettre tes deux jambes au sol, to put both of your feet on the floor, chaque jour, tu t'exerces. You have to exert. Pendant que tu t'exerces, while you exert, tu sens des douleurs. You can feel some pain. Mais le jour où tu vas y arriver, but the day you can do it, les gens vont t'applaudir. People start acclaiming you. Pendant qu'on t'applaudit, while they acclaim you, ils ne vont pas se souvenir des souffrances que tu as connues. They're not going to remember the sufferings that you had. Amen. 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 Mais cette souffrance, that suffering, est en train de te préparer au poncho. It's preparing you for the stage. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! There was something you gotta do. Yeah, no, you just can't. Does the man of God say? Ce que tu penses avoir gratuit, what you think you have for free, somebody paid for it somewhere else. Yeah, yeah, gratuit. There was nothing free. Yeah. Nothing. Make your salut. Even your salvation. Somebody has paid for it. And the Lord said. And the Lord said. There are plus de bonheur à donner qu'à recevoir. There was more pleasure giving it than receiving. Reste là quoi de bien demain? You just stay there folding your 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 hands. Je n'ai pas je n'ai rien. Je n'ai pas. I don't have anything. I can do nothing. Je n'ai pas je n'ai rien. I don't have I don't have anything. La maison c'est la vie. Your house will remain empty. I'll tell you the truth. I'll tell you the truth. A woman didn't know that. In time of crisis, the thing that could provoke a miracle in her house was in her house. When the prophet got there, he said, I'm hungry. She says, I have nothing. I am hungry. I want to eat. I have nothing. I have nothing. I am hungry. I want to eat. I have only only a little bit of flour and some oil. I'm waiting to make the bread. As soon as I'm done eating, my 
my child and I am going to die. I prevail with thee. The prophet told her, Fais moi ta boy, à manger. Cook for me first. Le peu que tu dois manger là. The little bit that you have to eat. Donne-le moi. Give it to me. Je n'ai rien. I have nothing. C'est un bandit. It's a thief. It's a thief. It's a crook. He came to empty my house. But she didn't know that the little bit she had was what you need. What you need to change your life. Hallelujah. Yes. Le peu. Little bit. Le peu. The little. Qu'est-ce que tu as dans ta main? What do you have in your hand? C'est ce que tu as besoin. Is what you need. That's what God needs. Qu'est-ce que tu as dans ta main? What do you have in your hand? C'est ce que tu as besoin. That's what God needs. Moïse, Moses, Dieu, Dieu, said that to God, I have nothing. Pour les combats Pharaon, to to go fight Pharaoh. Mais Dieu lui pose la question. But God asked him. Qu'est-ce que tu as dans ta main? What do you have in your hand? Un bâton. A staff. It said, take the staff. Go to Pharaoh with it. With the staff. He went to Pharaoh. What does God need? Is what you have. God wants to use what you have to change your life. You do not need to change your life. No. Are you listening to me? I went to the house of a woman who was a wife or servant of God. But in the Bible, the Bible tells us, "You can serve God and serve your wife." Serve your wife. 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 Otherwise, the day will die. The creditor will come and take back his house. And that's what happened to that woman. The husband was serving God. But he was in debt. Oh, écoutez-moi. Oh, listen to me. Vous qui avez l'habitude d'emprunter. You, you guys who used to uh, to borrow. Vous vous mettez vous-même sous les malédictions. You are placing yourselves under curses. Je suis interdit d'emprunter. God forbids to borrow. Et encore plus. And even more. Ceux qui veulent pas l'argent de l'église et qui ne remboursent pas. Those who come and take the money of the church, you know, be very, very attention. Be very, very careful. On ne peut pas échapper à Dieu. We cannot escape from God. God. When God gives you His money, make sure to give it back to Him. Otherwise, that money will become a curse. You will find you will not you will seek to find until you cry and you give back for the door to open. If you take money in this church, give back quickly. I'm leaving. I'm telling you the truth. It's not a show. If you want, take it the way you want. I'm teaching you the truth. The Bible says that you will know the truth and you will set you free. But you say that you want to get married. Even when you expect to get married, you don't leave anyhow. You don't like people who tell the truth. You have to be very careful. The woman remain with the husband's problems. The Bible tells us the prophet, the prophet, Elisha arrived there. A family. The woman told him, the creditor is coming, he's about to get my children. Because your friend who served God died with death. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. May God help us. This is an humiliation. You serve God but you die with death. And the creditor was coming to take the children of the man of God. If it wasn't for the prophet, 
been a catastrophe. It would have been a catastrophe. This scripture, what do you have? That scripture that they said. Do you have uh, 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 vessels? The vase. Some vases. And the vase. Just collect them. Do scripture. Everything you've got, take them. She didn't first go outside to get those vases. The vases were inside of her. What's going to change your life is not out of you. It is with you. It's in your hands. It's when the vases of your house were full. And she was she ran out of vases. That the oil stopped flowing. That is what we call the divine provision. I'm telling you the truth. God provides. There are many stories in the Bible that teach us and reveal to us that God provides. Prophet Elijah found himself in the desert. God sent a choir. And the raven in her mouth had a Amuka! <laughs> 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 oh God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The way when I pushed the hamburger building, amen. But the way it was supposed to keep that hamburger until the destination. Because the owner, because the recipient had to consume his hamburger. When God provides, nothing can oppose to it. Because that is what God has kept. That has to come back to you. I will repeat it. When God provides, nothing can prevent you from receiving. Because it is what you've kept that wishes you. Just like you've kept your money in the bank. If one day they tell you that you cannot get your money back, it's going to be war. You're going to remove your clothes before the banker. You will tell them, my money, give it back to me. Because you have the right. Somebody says amen. Somebody says amen. The first mean to provide or fill your account is to take care of the kingdom of God. I want to hear your amen. I want to hear your amen once again. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The Bible is clear on that. The first thing of provision is the kingdom of God. Matthew 6, verse 33. Matthew 6, verse 33. Seek ye first the kingdom and the righteousness of God. And all those things shall be added unto you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Listen to me carefully. Listen to me, please. I'm concluding, I'm drawing to the, to the end. The kingdom of God is also called the house of treasure. Now open Matthew 13, verse 44. You will understand something here. Matthew 13, verse 44. 44. I 
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Again, the kingdom of God of heaven is like unto treasure hidden in film. Okay, suivez moi. Listen to me. Le royaume de Dieu est comme un trésor. The kingdom of God is like a treasure. Un trésor. Dis avec moi trésor. Say treasure. Caché dans un champ. Hidden in a field. Et ce trésor est le trésor de Dieu. And that treasure is God's treasure. Et dans ce trésor, tu trouves tout ce dont tu as besoin. And in that treasure, you find all that you need. Qu'est-ce qu'il dit dans la continuité? What does it say is next? The which, the which when a man had found, he hid it. And for joy they were offered, go and sell all that he had, and buy that field. Écoutez, écoutez très bien. Listen. C'est triste. Suivez-moi. Listen, 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 please, listen, follow me. C'est lui qui trouve cette trésor. He who finds that treasure, he le prend, he takes it, he cash, he hides it, pour que quelqu'un d'autre le voit, so that nobody else sees it. He goes and he runs, he runs too, he sells everything to go and invest. Amen. 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 Pour avoir accès au to access au trésor, access to the treasures. Pourquoi vous vous battez beaucoup? Why do you struggle so much? J'ai trouvé le meilleur travail au monde. I have found the best job on earth. It's to serve God. Personne ne vient me licencier. Nobody will come and fire me. Alléluia. Je n'ai pas le stress. I have no stress. Je ne coupe pas après l'heure. I don't run after the time. Je gère mon temps avec Dieu. I handle my time with God. Alléluia. Amen. Et il m'a enrichi. And he made me rich. Pour vous enrichir. To make you rich. Amen. Ce que je vous donne, c'est la richesse. What I'm giving you is riches. C'est ça. That's it. Si vous mettez ces choses en pratique, if you put those things to practice, vous ne serez plus la même personne. You will no longer be the same person. Donc, en fait, so in fact, il n'y a pas de gain. There is no gain. S'il n'y a pas d'investissement, there is no investment. Maintenant, now, où est-ce que tu investis beaucoup? Where do you most invest in? C'est ton investissement qui détermine ce que tu vas gagner. It's your investment that determines what you will harvest. Et je dis ici, and God says here, je dis ici, I have said here, Dieu dit quand Dieu dit, on dit Dieu a dit. Quand Dieu dit, on dit Dieu a dit. When God says, we say God said. Là quand je dis, je dis, je dis. Now when I say, I say, I say. <laughs> je dis, I said, in my meditation this morning, in my meditation this morning, jusqu'à ce que tu sois prêt pour investir dans le royaume, until you are ready to invest in the kingdom, sinon tu n'auras pas accès au trésor qui est le royaume. Otherwise, you will not have access to the treasure which is the kingdom. In other terms, in other terms. God's treasure is for those who invest in God's kingdom. Amen. Amen. Voilà la première source. This is the first source. De la provision. Of provision. Si tu veux que Dieu pourvoie tes besoins. If you want God to provide your needs. Invest in His kingdom. Invest in His kingdom. Comment tu peux investir dans son royaume? How can you invest in His kingdom? C'est très simple. Very simple. Très simple. Very simple. Ta manière de donner les offrandes. Your way of giving your offerings. Va changer. Has to change. Il dit dans Malachi chapitre 3 verset 10. Il dit dans Malachi 3 10. Apportez dans la maison du trésor. Bring in the house of treasure. Vos dîmes ou vos offrandes. Your tithes and offerings. Voilà l'investissement. Here's the investment. Comment est-ce que tu donnes ton offrande? How do you give your offering? Je sais. I know. Que à majorité les gens donnent l'offrande par faux. 
conformism, by formality. That usually people give offerings by convention, by formality. Since it's in the envelope, nobody will see what I'm giving. So Don't take this to no. Il faut tout simplement que moi aussi je me lève quand on les offre. Moi aussi je me lève. Some say no, 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 no. I have to stand up when everyone is giving the offering. Si tu n'as pas la compréhension de ce que tu es en train de faire, tu ne bénéficieras rien. But if you do not have the understanding of what you're doing, you will not benefit of it. Qu'est-ce que tu es en train de faire en comportant ton offrande? What are you doing by bringing your offering? Tu es en train d'investir. You are investing. Ton investissement déterminera ce que tu vas gagner. And your investment will determine what you will harvest. En d'autres termes, je suis dit, in other terms, Jesus was saying, un petit investissement, a small investment, te permettra de gagner peu. Will allow you to win little. Celui qui sème peu, he will sow little. Ma son peu, he harvests little. Celui qui sème beaucoup, he will sow a lot. Ma son peu, he harvests a lot. Si tu veux attacher ton cœur, ne comprends pas. Attache, attache. If you want, just tie up your heart and let put it deprive from any understanding. Ferme tes oreilles, même où je vais parler. Ferme tes oreilles. Even if you want, you can even shut your ears. Alors que les autres seront en train de prendre leur envol, toi tu seras toujours au petit niveau. While everybody else will be taking the flight, you will still remain at the low level. Si tu te contentes du niveau où tu es, tu es misérable. If you are happy with the level you are at right now, you are miserable. Parce que Dieu veut que tu ailles plus loin. Because God wants to go further. Je vais dans ton amen. Pour les vieux, les hommes. Et souffrant de la dîme. Offrings and tithes. La dîme est différente de l'offrande. Tithes is different. For often, on ne négocie pas avec la dîme. We do not negotiate with the tithe. Mais c'est toi qui détermine ce que tu dois donner comme offrande. But for the offerings, you determine what you want to give. Mais pour ce qui concerne la dîme, for the tithe, c'est Dieu qui te dit ce que tu dois lui donner. It is God who gives you what you must give him. Il n'y a pas de démocratie dans la dîme. And there is no democracy in tithe. Où je vote, either I vote. Non, je vote, I vote, pour arrêter ce que je dois donner. To stop what I have to give. Non, non. Tu as dit, God said, tout ce que tu reçois, everything you receive, la dixième partie, remove the tenth of it, dix pour cent, ten percent. Il y a des gens qui ont commencé très sérieux. There are some people who started very seriously. When they had, they didn't have a lot of money. They were giving the tithes regularly. But when God manifested His faithfulness, they said, "How come?" I made, I made like two thousand dollars. How can I remove ten percent of two thousand dollars? Pastor, we are going to be rich. Pastor, one is going to become rich. Pourtant, il est que là pour prêcher la parole. We are just there to preach the word. Le raisonnement commence. Reasoning starts. Donc, je vais lever une partie pour les pauvres quartiers. No, I'm going to remove a part of it for the poor in the neighborhood. Non, ce n'est pas à toi de tout faire. No, it is not up to you to worry about the poor. It is all to the church. And you don't even take care of all the poor. Because they are poor and poor. There's some poor that when you give to them, you will not have anything anymore. Because it's a bad land, it's a bad one. You took your seed, you put it in the fridge. Or somebody has took the seed and found a good ground. There are some people who are fertile, spiritually fertile, spiritually fertile. And the first fertile territory is the royal territory, the kingdom of God. Amen. 
commences à raisonner parce que tu ne veux, tu veux pas obéir à ce que Dieu te demande. You start reasoning because you do not want to obey what God has asked you to do. Amen. 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 Si tu ne veux pas remplir l'argent pour lui, if you don't do it just to get about money, tu vas monter financièrement. You want to climb financially? Et parce que tu es sur une fausse fondation. But because you are on a bad foundation, demain tu vas tomber. Tomorrow you will collapse. Il n'y a rien qui te soutient en haut. Because there is nothing sustaining you up there. Amen. Deuxième source, second source. Deuxième source, second source. Les prophètes de Dieu. Prophets of God. Quand je parle de prophète ici, when I talk of prophets here, je parle des serviteurs de Dieu. I'm talking about servants of God. Matthieu chapitre 10. Matthieu chapitre 10. Verset 41. Verse 41. Matthieu 10, 41. Matthieu 10, 41. Okay. Are you on the page here? Can we read? He that receives a prophet in the name of a prophet yes. shall receive a prophet's reward. She will receive a prophet's reward. We will receive a prophet's reward. In other terms, you know terms? are you guys following me? The servant of God is a container. Is a, is a vessel the grace of grace. You have despised them at times too much. I'm giving you an example. The man I was talking about to you in a minute ago. He's a, he's a rich man. When he got back home, when he got to us in Cameroon, one day, I told my wife, Mama, Mama they just gave us a blessing in Europe. That money, we are not going to use it. 